Howdy folks, hope you're all having a good one, and welcome back to Choo Choo Charles, where in the previous episode, I discovered that my train is now so tough, so fast, and so well armed, that with judicious use of just the flamethrower, I don't even, well, need to use any other, well, even though I only have one other weapon at the moment, the machine gun, but the flamethrower alone, even though it doesn't do a huge amount of damage, does enough damage over time and imposes a slowing effect on Charles such that he can never actually catch my train, all the while taking damage as he fruitlessly tries to. So in other words, come on then Charles, bring it on bitch. <laughs> anyway, in case you were wondering what was going on looking at the map, I've decided, oh is there some scrap back there? Something, no, oh, whatever. Um, rather than I'm at the northern end of the island now, where I ended up running away from Charles <laughs> in the last episode. And um, I thought, well, I'm here, I'll, I'll explore what is up here. But then I thought better of it. Let, let's, let's try to focus and actually finish. Okay, two things. First, I missed the switch. The train was too far forward. Second, I'm getting shot at. Get oh, the flame not going to happen. I need to back up so I can actually make it over the switch that I just did. Let's switch to the machine gun. Backed up enough now. Forward. Right, who was that shooting at me? It's like there was one of. Oh, oh, oh. oh sorry. <laughs> oh, yes. I, I am getting shot at. It turns out that uh, it looks like the northern end of the island is a bit more dangerous than where I've been playing up until now. Areas like this that are crawling with Warren's extremely aggressive goons. And hang on a second, look at the train's hitbox. Did they do all that damage to the train with their shotguns? Holy shit. I need to get this train repaired in case Charles shows up. Um, hang on a minute. Where am I? Alright, repair the train. That's actually important. Down at one scrap. Ah, I missed the switch. Or did I? Hang on. Stop the train. Let's figure out where I am and which way I'm going. Yeah, I did miss the switch. I need to be going the other way. In order to head back and finish off the eastern end. What's that noise? Move the train, move the train, move the train. That's Charles. I definitely heard Charles. It's not just me, right? You heard it too. I, I don't see him, but I definitely heard him. All right. Uh, yeah, and of course I'm heading the wrong way. I need to be going back. And I'm not quite sure how well this flamethrower is going to work again. Oh, oh. <laughs> I don't think the weapons are going to work against something that's chasing you while you're going backwards. There's a bit of my train. Actually, I've got an idea. Oh, ow. Yeah, that does work. Ah. Huh. Okay, note to self. When Charles is chasing you... You don't even need to hit him to hurt him with the flamethrower. Just um, lay a carpet of flame down on the tracks, watch him run over it and hurt himself on it. Anyway, must focus. Uh, which is what I'm trying to do this episode. Because rather than just, oh well I'm here in the northern end of the island, now I may as well explore here. No, I still have undone missions down in the southern and eastern end of the island. What's his name? Santiago. Yes, his journal for example. Plus, there's a required NPC, an optional NPC, and a weapon NPC mission down at the other end of the island as well, which I really should... Well, one of them's a required NPC mission, so I'm, there's no should about it. I do have to do it, and I'm going to want that weapon. Plus any available scrap from the optional mission, so we're going to head back, try to get some focusing done, and finish what we've started bit concerned about Santiago's house. He said it would be dangerous to go back there. And there was a very ominous looking temple next to his house. I'm also kind of concerned that I just definitely heard Charles, but haven't seen him. Is he just fucking with me now or what? <laughs> We're still heading the right way? Yes. All the way back up there. There we go. That's where we're heading. Santiago's journal. Okay, it's going to be a long trip. I'll see you when we get there. So, 
Santiago's house. We're looking for his journal, but this is the spot I was trying to investigate last time when I got jumped by that bastard Charles and he ended up chasing me halfway across the other end of the island. Now do I go for the journal or do I investigate this strange looking temple here? Which is what I was trying to do when Charles appeared last time. Oh, this all looks... I don't think this was part of the original build. <laughs> I'm not seeing anything to do up here though, perhaps later. I reckon I might have to place one of the eggs there. Anyway, here we go. W what do you mean, what eggs? You really weren't paying attention a couple of videos ago, were you? Don't worry, I've forgotten about them too. Evil demon killer clown monster eggs. It's a long story, don't worry. It, I don't know scrap in here, but I ain't seeing any journal. And Santiago said it would be dangerous. So... So, well, there's the journal. Oh, more scrap. Got it. But where's the danger? Let's have a quick look around. Yep. More scrap lying around. Hang on. Hang on. Oh, yeah, we're going that way. <laughs> Follow the lights, Jingle. Right. That didn't seem hard. That would have been easy last time if Charles hadn't showed up. What are we doing? Seven scraps. All right, not good. Okay, um, I suppose we're going to back up. Yep, there's Santiago on the jetty. And uh, we'll have this one in. That was really easy. I don't get why Santiago was so quick to say it will be dangerous. It wasn't dangerous at all. Head backwards again. I don't. Uh, it'll be fine. I mean, if Charles approaches, I'll just have to leave him and chase the other end of the island again. Because I don't think you can really fight Charles while going backwards in the train. I mean, at some point, he's going to end up in front of the train. Which, if you're going backwards, is behind the train. But now we, you get the idea. How the hell can you use the weapons on him if he's chasing you and you're going backwards? I don't know. Let's hope it never comes to that. Right, I think this is our stop. Did I see... I think I saw... some loot in the siding. Area. Where was it? Not there. Nope. Was I imagining things? Oh, there it is. Yeah. Right, so Santiago is waiting down there on the jetty. Oh, more loot. Uh, waiting down there on the jetty for a ship to come and take him away. He's probably going to die of old age before that happens, but he can't leave without his journal, which is what he sent us back to his house to collect. Don't know what's in the journal. Frankly, don't care. I just want the scrap. Speaking of which, keep an eye open for any more scrap down here. Although I think we did clear this place out last time. Yeah, not seeing anything. Okay, I've got your book. Thank you so much for bringing my journal. I would hope, for your own good, that you didn't peek inside. Uh, I would have. Game didn't but, give me um, the option. Here are those scraps I promised. Hooray! Right. Get back to that train before Charles makes another appearance. How many scraps we got? It doesn't tell you. It just tells you, you know, scraps of water. It doesn't say how many. And you can't check how many, or if there is a way of checking how many, I haven't found it yet, without being on your uh, train itself and looking at the blueprints. So, here's hoping. We've got enough for an upgrade. I think we need, I don't know, a lot, because the train's almost fully upgraded now. Made it back to the train without getting jumped by Charles. Let's have a look see. Ooh, 44 scraps. Ooh, damage level 10. <laughs> oh yeah. Now, did that change the way the train looks? Um, I can't remember what it looked like before. <laughs> Maybe. I don't know. It didn't change the way the guns look. 
flamethrower still looks like the flamethrower. Yeah, weapons still have the same stats. But then again, I suppose the stats are comparative. They're kind of relative rather than absolute. I don't know, whatever. Anyway, maximum damage upgrade. All that remains is speed. And for that, let's see, we have a weapon, an optional, and a required mission. And they're all right next to each other. And they're just at the other end of the tracks. So let's head up there and see what's what. Oh, hang on a minute. Yes, I'm going to need to uh, throw the switch. I need to go right. It's currently set to go left. It was heading up that way that led us all the way up to the north western end of the island in the last episode, running away from Gerald. Train is looking very nice now, by the way. Yes. So, um, there are another two weapon missions. And I've heard there's a rocket launcher in this game. I haven't seen it myself yet. But I think the required NPC mission that we're about to see is to get the second egg from the second... What the hell's in there? Hang on a second. Let us investigate. Oh, should I? Ooh. Oh, wait a minute. You hear that? It's not just me, is it? Where are you, you bastard? I can hear... There he is! Whoa! Whoa! Let's go, let's go, let's go! Man the guns. No, let's get the flamethrower. Come and have a go if you think you're hard enough, Charlie boy. You definitely saw him, right? I wasn't imagining things. Where the hell is he? Come on then, Charlie. I'm ready for you with my fully upgraded weapons. I'm not just imagining things, right? I mean, I heard him, and then the music took an ominous turn, and then I saw him down the other end of the tracks. But where the hell is he? Is he just fucking with me? <laughs> <laughs> Does he actually do that? <laughs> uh, right, I'll, the, yeah, there was a very suspicious looking set of lights leading off up a path in the distance on the left hand side of the tracks there that I was going to investigate, but with Charles running around in the proximity, I don't think I'm going to do that. Instead, let's focus. And, uh, oh, there's another one of these. Just open them up and grab all the scrap things. Chests, yes, that's the word. Wow, you wouldn't believe English is my first language, would you? <laughs> Still no sign of Charles. He was definitely back there. Right, so um, we've got a weapon mission in here, I think. Ooh, is that a rocket launcher? That looks like a rocket launcher. It's a rocket launcher. Paul asked me to design a new weapon to help you hunt Charles. And using my extensive demolitions experience, I made this rocket launcher. It's a rocket launcher. <laughs> I've wanted to see Warren's empire crumble for a long time. So oh. building this puppy was a hell of an opportunity. Now that you're here, I need a few minutes to remove some safety features. While I'm working on that, why don't you bring that box of rocket ammunition back here from inside the bunker down the rail? This gonna be good. Right, any more stuff in here? Let's check upstairs. Uh, something. Get a scrap and a note. Bloody, 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 blah. Make a rocket launcher. Make a rocket launcher. Yeah. Okay. Fine. He's made a rocket launcher. I need to go and find the ammunition. Okay, that's fine. That's that seems fair. Let's have a look around that. Oh, what's that? There's another building on the other side of... Seems strange. Alright, let's take a look around. Scrap. There's a path leading off into the woods. I do not trust paths that lead off into the woods. What's up here? Scrap on the balcony. Oh, a dude. And some scrap. And a note. Blah, 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 blah. Hatch and raise eight-legged critters, army for who knows what. Yeah, he's crazy. It doesn't mean he's wrong, <laughs> but he is crazy. Hello. I, I'm sure Eugene told you all about me, so I need not introduce myself. Ah, name's Greg, by the way. I see what he did there. In case you heard already, <laughs> Warren, the mind boss, is keeping three monster eggs locked away. 
We're unsure why he wants to protect the eggs. If they hatch, they would surely turn into monstrous creatures like Charles. To prevent this, we need to steal all three and, and use them to bait Charles so we can destroy him. Uh, one, one of the eggs is, is in the North Mine. Uh, here's, here's the key to the entrance. Oh, so Crazy Greg here must be the required NPC that I have to meet. Alright, that's two with one stone, that's good. Um, anyway, yes, rocket launcher ammo. He said it's... Oh, more scrap. Right. Yeah, oh, great stuff. Not I think that's the first one that I've actually seen on this island. Oh, more scrap. Anyway, yes, so... Smith, I think his name was. The guy making the rocket launcher. Wow. Right, so, yeah. That north mine is a hell of a distance away, but this is the bunker break-in for the weapon that we're doing. That's the north mine where the second egg has to be retrieved. Well, we'll worry about the north mine later. Let's get this rocket launcher. So it is definitely this way. It was kind of confusing because the guy said it's down the rail, assuming that there was a rail to the mine, but there isn't. It's just a path. It, um... Hang on. Is that a danger explosive sign? That's a danger explosive sign. Is this a minefield? <laughs> right, so anybody who's played Far Cry 6 will be aware that mines make very loud and distinctive beeping noises when you get anywhere near them. Or is that tripwise? It's so easy to confuse the two. I don't think this is a minefield. What is that? There's definitely something over there. Is that... Is that dynamite? That's dynamite. That's scrap. That's a scrap. And I can pick up the dynamite. But I was sent here to get rocket launcher ammo. I don't understand. What's the dynamite for? I, I'm, I'm sure this will all become clear in a moment. So this must be the... Ah, uh, explosives on the bunker door. Yeah, I'll get it. Get a safe distance. Ooh, more scrap. All right. Right, in. Pick up our rockets. Out. What's going on? Where's the rockets? Why is that mine cart full of explosives? What? Oh shit. Back up. Back up. Back up. <laughs> and we're going to live. Oh, right, there was another blocked door that needed to be blown up. I'm doing quite well for removing doors that need to be blown up with explosives that I didn't know I needed to use. Right. Let's grab all of this scrap. There's another note. Rocket launcher ammo testing. Okay, whatever. Let's grab the rocket launcher ammo. And get the hell out of here. Ho, ho, ho. Soon I will have a rocket launcher. Oh shit. I am definitely not imagining this. That's Charles. I can hear him. I can't see him, but I can definitely hear him. Oh. Is he just fucking with me again? Or am I about to become spider bait? Um, I could just hide in the bunker. He's not going to be able to get in there. Or I could make it back to the train. I don't know, it's a fair old distance away. <laughs> Can I make it? Which way is it? Check the map. Yes. Okay, I'm facing the right way. It's less than 200 meters. I can do this. There's no stamina bar, so I can just sprint forever. This is fine. I don't hear him anymore. Less than 100 meters to go. When you're there, this is fine. It's all good. Soon, I will have a rocket look. Oh shit. No, 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 Oh, come on. I was, I was that close to, oh. You sneaky fucking Russian. 
Charles, I never knew you had it in you. I can see I'm going to have to start treating Choo Choo Charles with a little bit more respect, the sneaky bastard. First he spends this entire video just fucking with me. <laughs> and then he lures me out into an ambush. Charles, definitely going to have to start treating you with a bit more respect. However, just remember, the next time we meet, I will have a rocket launcher. That's it for today, folks. Have yourselves a great weekend, and as always, take care, and I'll catch you next time.